Hi everyone, this is Mr. Lara, and in this video we'll be learning how to convert any fraction to percent. Last lesson, we learned what a percent is. A percent is used to represent a part of a whole where the denominator is equivalent to 100. We also learned that we can convert any fraction into a percent by multiplying and changing its denominator to 100. In this lesson, we will be learning how to convert a fraction to a percent by dividing its numerator by its denominator. For this example, we will be converting the fraction of 3 eighths to a percent. Ooh. To convert this fraction to a percent, I must first convert it to a decimal by dividing its numerator by its denominator, or the top number by the bottom number. It is very important to divide the top number by the bottom if I divide the bottom by the top, I will not convert the fraction correctly and will end up with the wrong answer. Since I cannot subtract any groups of 8 from 3, and since 3 is a smaller number than 8, I need to add a decimal and two zeros. Think of exchanging $3 bills for 300 pennies. They both are equal in value. I just broke up the dollar bills into coins or smaller parts I can divide. I can add a decimal and an infinite amount of zeros to any whole number without changing its value. Now I can start dividing in the ones place. How many groups of 8 can I subtract from 3? I cannot subtract any groups of 8 from 3, so I must move on to the next place value, which is in the tenths place. Since I'm now subtracting from the tenths place, I need to add a decimal in the quotient. How many groups of 8 can I subtract from 30? I can subtract 3 groups of 8. 8 times 3 is 24. I am left with a remainder of 6. It is important to know that I'm placing the 3 in the tenths place because that is the place value I'm subtracting from. I can now bring down a 0 from the hundreds place. How many groups of 8 can I subtract from 60? I can subtract 8 groups of 7 or 56 because 8 times 7 is 56. I am left with a remainder of 4. To continue dividing, I can add a 0 to the dividend and bring it down. How many groups of 8 can I subtract from 40? 5 times 8 is equal to 40. I can subtract 8 groups of 5 from 40. 3 over 8 is equal to 375 thousandths. To change this to a percent, I simply need to multiply the answer by 100 or move the decimal two spaces to the right. If you're looking to master various concepts in math and science, you can subscribe to our channel. So make sure not to miss out on any future content.